Be careful now. I've got the shivers, they're talking to me, excuse me. You can feel it, the hair, your hair stands on end. That's when you know they're talking to you telepathically, you know they're warning me, I think. I think that's a good right. idea, yeah. <laughs> rock me! <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't rock that. You've got to experience that. I'm sorry. I shouldn't laugh. Fovian, Fovian, that was a bit uncalled for. <laughs> They're just hungry. Um, I've got heart here for Fobian and Johnny, <laughs> they're like ravenous, you know. If they want to be fed at two or three in the morning, I'll get up and feed them at two or three in the morning. It's just what I do. This one's a little guts. Do you want it? Hey, come on. You're a bit camera shy. Come on. Good girl. Don't be so snappy. I think I've got 33 animals, including the birds. Four freshwater crocodiles, a male and a female, and they're two young'uns. And outside in another area I have Gilly or Gilfia. Most of them are homeless animals. People say, oh, it's cruel having them as domestic pets running around the house and stuff. Well, they seem to be comfortable with it. If they can breed, mate and breed, well, I must be doing something right. They just wouldn't survive in the wild. I'd much rather see them in the wild, but I try and give them as much freedom as I can in the home instead. Look, he's still got the meat in his mouth. Don't you want it? Hmm? Yes. Look, look the turtle trying to get it out of his mouth. And you want another one? You're hungry now. Good girl. Johnny was left on my doorstep as a hatchling, and fortunately I was able to license her, and that was about 22 years ago. I remember the first time she climbed up on the bed, I was with my ex-husband then, stroking what I thought was a cat. And then I woke up and it was Johnny was on my chest with a snout here. And from that day onwards, she slept on the bed with me for years. Between my husband and I, mind you. <laughs> Many times there's been myself, my two cats and Johnny on the bed sleeping for the night. So, I mean, you take me, you take my animals, simple as that. She was getting bigger and I thought, mm, let's see how you go on a harness and leash. What are you doing, Johnny? What are you doing, Johnny? And it's amazing. She adapted to it straight away. She knew. However, we, we have to abide by the regulations so we don't do it anymore. No, 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 no. Settle down, settle down, settle down. Uh, uh, it's all right. It's OK. The babies, they're just so adorable. Yeah. Oh, dearie, I mean. Oh, really? The other thing is, I don't want people to think that you can just go out and get a crocodile and make it into a pet. They are dangerous animals. You need to know a lot about them. There's a lot more than just getting a pond for it. Jilly! The neighbours, if they kicked up a stink and they have a right to, then I have to move. But they've been great. They've been terrific, so I've been lucky. Hey, baby. Gentle, gentle, good girl, good girl, she's a good girl, yes yeah, she is, you're beautiful aren't you? She would never stare at them in the eyes, it is a challenge. I yelled at her one day because she did get one of my trooks, but she sulked. She went into the corner over here and she sulked and I swear when I came and checked on her, she had tears running down out of her eyes. They do have emotions, they're special. Sure, they might take the odd human life, but what was that human doing in their area? This is a new enclosure I've been trying to get built for quite some time. So she's got a large insulated enclosure on a pension. I obviously can't afford it, you know. I'm flat out trying to feed the animals. Then I shouldn't have them, but they come before me anyway, food-wise. My mum said oh, she would like to see them go. I'd like to see you have a life before you die, you know. So yeah, I've sacrificed my life for them. Animals have always been my life and without them I don't think I sort of wouldn't have a life. I couldn't imagine being without them, like, wow. <laughs>